Hey guys. So I'm excited um, to announce my first haul is going to be with um, for BH Cosmetics. Um, I actually am probably going to make two or three videos today. That's really loud. Hangover 2 is on. <laughs> but um, so yeah. I, I'm just going to do my first haul for BH Cosmetics. I just got this in today and I'm really excited because I ordered it before Thanksgiving for the Black Friday sale and um and you know um I ordered it and then I come this weekend after Thanksgiving I started looking up reviews because I was like I was tracking it to see where it was and and all this stuff and and I was just like you know what I didn't even look at a review I mean obviously I've seen reviews on YouTube um, and I've heard all great stuff, but, you know, someone said, uh, somewhere on the website, it was like a fake website, and I was like, I hope I wasn't on the fake one, and so, like, I started freaking out and looking up the reviews, and people said, you know, some people were like, I never got my stuff, and then some people said it was cracked, and then some people, like, they ordered palettes, and then they ordered, like, stuff like this, and it didn't, like, this stuff didn't come with it. So I was like, oh my god, and, and I was, like, so nervous, because I spent, like, $57 um, on what I got. So, obviously, I know you guys have seen, I'll show you guys this stuff. Um, this is just, so I'm going to try to, like, review it, slash, um, do a haul. So this is the 88 um, Cool Shimmer Eyeshadow Palette. And it's really pretty, and I actually used it today um, for the first time. I think I used this color, and I used this color, and this one, and then um, which one? This green one. And I actually, I did my makeup like this um, because I have this shirt that I just got, and I got it from Walmart. So it matches pretty good, I think. Um, I was kind of rushed while I was doing it, so so that's that, and I'm very happy with the palette, and I'm even more happy because this one is the 120 um, second edition palette, and these are a lot bigger than the 88 palette, so I'm like, wow, this is going to last me forever, and um, I love this cool little purple tab that it came with, that lift lift this out of. Um, uh -oh. okay, yeah. So yeah, I got, got all these colors. This is the second edition. I was kind of stuck on which edition to get, um, and which one I like the most, but I think I'm happy with this one because, um, my eyes are green, so it's got a lot of greens, lots of purples. I love purple, um, and then some pinks and then, like, neutral colors, and even the yellows. I'm kind of into the yellows, too. So, um... And, and it's, I'm really excited too. My hair was blonde, and this weekend I just did it red. And I know it's going to be a pain in the ass to upkeep. It's already fading. But um, my mom's hair is this exact same color, So and I went to see her in Arizona. Um, so I'm actually, I'm loving it um, a little bit better than the blonde. But I do miss my blonde hair because I just love blonde hair, and it took it's really hard to get my hair blonde. So, like, I finally had it at the um, blonde color that I wanted, and even though I was doing it myself, um, and it wasn't perfect, it was still pretty good for doing your own blonde hair. So, um, anyways, ah, sidetrack. Um, so then I got this foundation primer, and I didn't even know, but it actually has vitamins A, E, and A and D in grapeseed extract, and it's for all skin types and it's clear and it's a pretty good amount um, and the way I do it I know you guys are probably gonna freak out because um, I have brushes I even have like a foundation brush I love Avon um, brushes I don't know if you guys want to check out Avon brushes but um, these aren't my Avon ones I can't find them right now but they work really really good and what in the Avon brush actually foundation the Avon foundation brush is pretty much just like this and this is Soho um and so this cost me like twenty dollars ah. but um okay but so yeah so but what I do and um I know I've seen videos um people were, like reviewing brushes and stuff like that but um I actually I don't like when people use their hands I freak out because whenever I touch my face with my hands 
I end up getting like I end up breaking out sometimes so what I do is like I'll take this or even my foundation because sometimes you can't carry around like all these brushes with you and I haven't been carrying around my makeup lately but if I have a purse like this is this is my purse right now it's just this little uh, Louis Vuitton um, bag so I just put like you know my ID in there and my money and whatever else my phone so I can't carry around those brushes um, but when I do have my bag like my big bag oh my gosh it's filled with makeup no matter what um, but yeah this is what I'll do I'll I'll show you with my left hand I'll actually squirt it right here and um, and you always want to go out so like I'll just I'll squirt it right there in my hand and I'll go out and put it on like that a lot of times and I've and it's like you know it's always clean right there you know I hate it when people do this like it's just oh it freaks me out because I can't do that or else I'll break out and like when I'm in the shower whenever before I touch my face no matter what I wash my hands obviously I'm sure a lot of you do that but um, even when I'm in the shower, even when I know my hands are clean after I shampoo and everything, I'll sometimes wash my hands twice. And I'll like sing, um, oh, my school actually, because I, I went to beauty school, they say to sing happy birthday um, to yourself three times. So happy birthday to me, and, and you do it three times and scrub your hands the whole time with soap. So, um, so yeah, I do that. I am a freak about, I have like OCD about, um, washing my hands. I even, I, I always have to have sanitizer. But yeah, so, but if that's a cool neat trick, just so you guys know, like, just, if you use this, you're good. And it comes on, it actually applies, like, really, really smooth, um, surprisingly. I actually, today, I didn't even use a brush when I put, when I put this on and my foundation and, um, it comes out really smooth. And another thing, just a little quick tip, um, you want to go out like this. Um, even if you're using a brush, you always want to go um, out like that. And then with your forehead, you go up, and i um, pretty sure you go out like this with your chin. So you're going out. You never want to go in. Um, that's just what I learned that's like in my books and everything. I've got a whole bunch of um, cosmetology books, um, hair designing books. So I'm going to be doing a whole bunch of tutorials and stuff like that. I've got tons of reviews I want to do right now, but um, I don't want to be like 20 videos from like the same day. But um, I'm sorry, let me go on with my haul. And then I got the eye primer and it's really, really cute and little. Um, it's, it's, it says, it's a silky base to be applied to the eye area prior to makeup application. Um, oh yeah, I wanted to review this for you guys too. Um, this long-lasting waterproof formula helps prevent creasing while neutralizing the lid to bring out optimal color. I think it worked amazing, and I haven't had to touch it up at all. The only thing I've had to touch up is my goddamn mascara. <laughs> it's driving me nuts. Um, and I'm going to do my whole mascara obsession video probably right after this one. But yeah, so it's just this really, really, really little tiny thing. But um, it's cute as anything. And a little goes a long way. Um, you just need a tiny little bit. I use my little Avon brush that I can't find right now, but I love that brush. And, um, and it's actually kind of like a, a yellowy color. Like it's almost like the top right underneath my eyebrow is what it looks like when you put it on. So I put it, I put it all on and, um, it just made my eyes like all bright. And then, um, like I said, it's pretty, it's worked, it's working pretty good so far. And the only thing, like, this is amazing. I have other primers that I got from, like, CVS and stuff. And, um, obviously they're not clear. Like, one is, like, a scrub. It's my BB cream. And it almost feels like you're putting on, like, um, like, scrub on your face. Like, that facial scrub stuff. But, um, this is just really smooth, really light on my, on your skin. It made, it made my face look extremely smooth. Like, way smoother than the, um... The other one I was using from CVS, and I actually like the other one from CVS, I mean the one I was using from CVS anyways. It's just a BB primer, um, I can't find it right now, but I'll show you guys um, later. Um, but yeah, so the only thing that so far I wasn't sure of, it's working amazing, it's keeping everything in place, but I noticed when I was putting my foundation on after, um, it just kind of like had just a little clear, like, not plastic, um,
thing, but like basically it, some of it came off. So it was dried up and it kind of came off. Like it almost looked like a clear little glue, but it wasn't gluey. It was soft. Just It was just dried up of this. And it was obviously from like rubbing the foundation on. Um, maybe I went like back and forth and kind of crinkled it together or something. So that was the only thing that kind of sucked. But also, again, I was using um, right here opposed to a brush. So um, I'll figure that part out later because I know obviously it's not supposed to do that and I must have done something wrong. But yeah, that was the only bad part about it. And it was only a tiny little, tiny little bit. Like it only did it on one side. I think it was this side. And it was just like just small little clear like um, little pieces. So um, that was pretty much um, it. That's all I got. But again, I'm excited. And like I said, I mean, this is, it is so, oh my gosh, it's like, you don't even know it's there. Like, I, I kept putting more on, and I'm like, I don't even feel it there. It's really, really light. Um, it's clear. It kind of made my face a little bit red. Like, some of my um, imperfections kind of started, like, sticking out, opposed to, like, when I use the BB primer. Immediately, it's like I already put makeup on when I use the BB primer, um, but, like, this weekend. It, it's like I didn't even need to put on foundation after that because it covers it because um, it's it's not clear obviously it's a light skin tone color so um, this may make it pop out at first but I mean mainly my whole thing is having a nice even um, smooth look so I love it so far I know I said the whole crinkly thing but I love it and again, and I love this eye primer, definitely love it. So I'm excited and I love my palettes. And um, yeah, so that's pretty much it for my first haul, BH Cosmetics. Um, I'm super happy because, oh, some of the reviews, if you look it up, are horrible. Like, and there's a lot of negative reviews. So I was like, so, I'm so happy I got my stuff all together on time in one piece. Um, and it was pretty fast. Um, I got it pretty fast too, so I'm really excited about that, and um, I just want to share with you guys, and I'm probably going to do another video after this. I have so much I want to show you guys, um, and I'm really excited because I'm going to be doing a lot of tutorials on like skincare, um, like nails, makeup, I'm going to be teaching how to do like finger waves, or how to do, I have a whole I mean, I've got all my, my school books, so there's like tons of braids, different types of braids to do, um, so much stuff that I wanted, I could do videos on, and I'm really looking forward to it, and I really hope you guys like it, so I hope you like this video, um, and you press like, and you subscribe, and if not, then just hit dislike and ignore me, and whatever, it's fine, I understand can't be loved by everyone but um but yeah and hangover 2 is on in the background so sorry about that and yes my mom did my nails rainbow colored so <laughs> they're kind of crazy looking and they're chipping but yeah um I have a whole bunch of new nail polishes that I love so I could do a, I have a couple hauls I'm gonna do um for my first couple videos it's probably all gonna be hauls and then I'll get into like the cool neat stuff like all the beauty secrets that um I learned and forgot a lot of them I forgot so I'm really excited and I hope you guys subscribe I promise you won't regret it and yeah um that's about it so I'll see you guys um in my next video okay talk to you soon Mwah.